Hello, Jane Cleland here. The question is, I have a backstory memory. Should that be in a separate chapter? Well, probably not. I recommend integrating backstory a little bit at a time, connecting it to a current event through some sensory reference. A woman walks into a bakery and smells the sweet cinnamon, and it brings her back to her childhood with grandma and how grandma oh, always would bake fresh bread. And she just loved those summers year after year until dad came that one time and took her away. And here comes the clerk saying, Hi, how can I help? So I put her in the bakery. I get her out of the memory, bookending it through current events. That's an organic way to share some backstory. And it lets us know something important. Dad wasn't so nice for some reason, but we don't know what it is. That's a good way to create a little suspense as well. I hope that helps. I know you can do it. If this tip had value for you, would you like it? Would you share it? Would you subscribe to the channel? I'd be so appreciative. Thank you.